Man's best friend. Who doesn't love dogs? Dogs originated from Europe and Asia, with modern dogs being descendants of wolves that are much more tame in nature while still sharing similar levels of intelligence. Dogs have been with us for centuries. However, perseverance in different climates, their training and breeding has added to the process of evolution, leading to rare breeds of dogs. These ones will definitely perk your ears and spike your interest. So stick around until the end as we go over some of the rarest breeds of dogs in the world. Number nine, Peruvian Inca Orchid. Affectionate, loyal, and noble, the Peruvian Inca Orchid is labeled as one of the rarest dogs in the world. They are elegant and slim. Bred in Peru, the dog can have a beautiful coat of hair or even come hairless, with skin color varying depending upon how the breeding turns out. This breed of dogs can be as tall as 26 inches and is considered to be a great guard dog as its attention to detail is immaculate. The Inca Orchid is alert at all times. The breed dates all the way back to 750 AD, with the dog painted in portraits or made into sculptures. Incas were considered to bring its owner's luck, and its warm skin was said to be a great treatment for arthritis. We're not sure if that's scientifically possible, but in 1966, an American went to Peru and brought eight dogs back for breeding purposes and after that, the breed was established in Europe and the U.S. Number 8. Tilamyan Found in Southeast Asia, the Tilamyan breed of dogs is not that well known among people. These adorable jungle dogs were bred by the Orang Asli, the oldest inhabitants of Malaysia, and hence the dogs developed traits according to the needs of the time. Since Orang Asli's would live in raised houses so as to ward off snakes, vermin, and predators, this dog developed an unusual ability to climb, which is not found in any other dog around the world. Imagine looking for them in the yard and seeing them up in the tree. Their paws have adapted to this and can have sufficient grip to open and close doors. The dogs are used to hunt food, guard the family, and for herding sheep. Some of the characteristics of the dog include large erect ears, long body, brown eyes, and social ability among others. It is said that training of this dog is quite the task and one needs to keep the animal occupied at all times. Hey, real quick, if you're new to the channel, welcome. Go ahead and give this video a like and hit that subscribe button for more videos like these. Number seven, Norwegian Lundhund. You might mistake the Norwegian Lundhund for a skinnier, longer corgi or an Akita with its dense coat and triangular ears and short rectangular looks. But if you take a closer look, this dog has some very unique features and capabilities and therefore makes it one of the rarest dog breeds in the world. Having six toes with an extra paw pad might throw you back, but its elastic neck is what might surprise you the most. The Norwegian Lundhund is super flexible for a dog and can turn its head 180 degrees and touch its spine just like the possessed do in The Exorcist, but in a cute way. Its ears can fold or close like a bunny, which is highly unorthodox for a dog. They have extended shoulders that can allow the dog's legs to be completely perpendicular. So what's the history of this special breed of dog? Well. The name, Norwegian, is attached to the breed as these dogs were bred on a rocky island off the Norwegian coast initially. The rocky island, Varoy, had a few hundred people who survived on pickled puffin meat throughout the year to sustain the cold, harsh environments. The crimson-coated canine evolved for centuries, adapting to such hostile climates, allowing them to become flexible and strong. These qualities helped the dog get into tough to reach crevices by climbing on the rocks and wiggling their way into such tight places to grab the puffins. Number six, Lagotto Ramen Yellow. Also known as the Italian truffle dog, Lagotto Ramen Yellow is definitely considered to be one of the rarest as they are the oldest water retrievers in the world. They're known as truffle dogs as the Lagotto are used to sniff out the highest quality of truffles in Italian grounds. This breed is known for its curly fur, which covers the entire dog from its head to their toes. 
These dogs are small in size, standing at around 20 inches and only weigh 35 pounds. This cute fluffy canine should not be taken lightly because of its adorable looks, as in reality, they're known for its strength and endurance. The demand for this breed of dogs shot through the roof during the medieval times when the legato were used to fetch ducks. Here is where they adopted, evolved, and developed waterproof fur and a muscular build. The dogs would venture out into the Italian marshlands to find ducks and bring them to feed their owners. Their sharp sense of smell would lead them straight to the ducks, even in the dirtiest of marshlands. As Italy progressed, ducks were bred for food, eliminating the need for hunting to survive. Since these dogs developed a great sense of smell and were nimble and agile, they were trained and used to procure truffles from the ground below. Number five, Ozawa. Ozawa dog breed is a symbol of elegance and sheer beauty. They sort of look like poodles, but are taller and longer. These dogs have a slender body covered in a short, fine coat that can be found in different color combinations, red, white, blue, black, and brown, to name a few. The Ozawa is a lore coarse dog in the United States that chases a mechanically operated lore. This is because of its tall legs and slim body that the Ozawa is able to spear through in any direction. They are known to be great companions and guardian dogs that will remain loyal until the very end. The Ozawa is a very lean breed of dogs. You can see their bone structure under their skin. Hunting animals over the years have developed this breed into a lean and muscular dog. What makes this breed so unique is because of their aerodynamic shape, which allows them to speed up in any direction to hone in on their prey. The elegance and fineness of the dog should not be mistaken as the Ozawas are not just cute, they are also tough hunters and have been chasing animals across scorching deserts of Africa for centuries. These dogs were initially trained to guard tents in the desert from wild animals like wolves, snakes, and more. The deserts of Africa not only shaped this breed of dog, but also gave it a keen eyesight that is so sharp that it can track prey even in a sandstorm. Oddly, these dogs are very shy around new people However, they are very loyal and comforting companions. Number four, Otterhound. Otterhounds look absolutely majestic as they run across a field. They are a sight to see and considered to be one of the rarest breeds of dogs. These dogs were first used in the medieval times to protect the fishing population. England's diet was fish in the early days and otters would feed on these fishes in ponds and rivers, declining the food rations for Britishers back then. As a deterrent, the British started using otter hounds to ward away the otters. These dogs would swim through rivers and ponds, thus developing strong shoulders and a broad chest. The otter hounds are expert swimmers and can swim for hours before getting weary. Their large nose is sensitive and can sniff out otters from great distances. Their sizes allowed them to fight large otters that would weigh at least 20 pounds. And if you know about otters, you know they can be quite scrappy. This breed is definitely on the verge of extinction as only 24 puppies were born last year in the UK, making them rarer than the white rhino. Number three, Moody. Known to be highly alert and active, the Moody breed, or as commonly pronounced as Moody, is a well sought after dog. With declining numbers, the dogs are priced extremely high as their intelligence allows them to perform any task after being trained in it. The dog can not only demonstrate watchdog duties, but also is great in search and rescue missions for law enforcement authorities, hunting for survivalists and more. These dogs are also known as the Hungarian Moody. The Moody was used back then by shepherds in order to take care of their flocks. Herding skills of the Moody is absolutely phenomenal as these breeds of dogs are able to manage up to 500 sheep in one go. Since these dogs are great shepherds, their stamina and strength needs to be used throughout the day, making them have very high exercising needs. The dogs can, however, be trained positively to remain calm and collective making them great pals under proper supervision. There are a total of less than 1,000 Moody dogs around the world, making them an extremely rare breed. 
You might come across them in eastern parts of Europe, but since they're very low in numbers, the chances of seeing one is minimal. Number 2. Commodore Have you been lucky enough to pet a Commodore in your lifetime? These rare and delightful shaggy pooches look like they would be great for mopping floors, but they are so much more than that. Commodores have a long and noble history. They used to protect flocks in their native home of Hungary, and to this day, they're still very protective and excellent watchdogs over their humans. They will defend family and property with their lives. Their mop-like coat is actually used as a clever form of camouflage. The woolly fur helps them blend in when watching over the flocks of sheep. They use their looks as an advantage when a wolf tries to sneak in to snack on the sheep. The guard dogs can surprise the predator and protect the flock. They are very affectionate and playful and intelligent dogs that want to please. They need to get plenty of exercise and have to have room to roam free and burn energy. As you might have guessed, the dog's coat needs a lot of care. Their fur forms natural dreadlocks after about two years of age. And unfortunately, this doesn't make their grooming routine easy. Bathing this dog can take some time and their cords take a while to dry off. If owners don't properly clean these pups, they can start to get pretty smelly. Number one, Chinook. The Chinooks are by far, hands down, the rarest breed of dogs in this world. They are muscular and tawny coated. They're amazing canine companions that love to hike, compete in dog sports, or just play with the kids. The dogs can stand as tall as 26 inches with their strong builds. However, female dogs are much smaller and have an elegant feminine look, which can be easily distinguishable from afar. Chinooks are definitely rugged breeds with great patience and intelligence. Their history is worth knowing about as you might not come across a Chinook breed in your lifetime. An adventurer, Arthur Treadwall Walladen from England, went on an expedition to Alaska in 1896, where he worked many different jobs, of which sled dog driver was one of them. Upon returning back to England, Arthur wanted to devote his time in breeding sled dogs. He started with a Mastiff type dog and a Greenland Husky, breeding them for pups, which were highly praised for their sledding abilities, yet affectionate in nature. One of his sled dogs, who would almost always lead the pack in his time in Alaska, was known as a Chinook. Inspired by such creatures, he decided to name his breed of dogs Chinook too. Arthur's breeding program became well known across the world among sledding enthusiasts. He and his team of dogs were used for an expedition to Antarctica in 1928, where the team moved around 3,500 pounds of supplies over a distance of 16 miles. Without Arthur and his team of dogs, this perilous task was almost impossible. In 1947, Arthur passed away in an attempt to save his wife from a burning farmhouse, and soon his breeding program had died down with the number of Chinooks declining rapidly. By 1965, there were only 125 Chinooks left, which has further taken a nosedive before dog enthusiasts decided upon themselves to preserve this breed of dogs. Thanks for watching. Dogs have been loyal pets for centuries and great companions. However, having one in your home requires special care, love, and attention. If it weren't for dog enthusiasts all over the world, we wouldn't even have the current species of dogs, let alone these rare ones. Now that you've been enlightened about the rarest breeds of dogs in the world, let us know in the comments section below which one do you think would make a great family member and why. Give this video a like and be sure to subscribe for more videos like these. See you next time. Bye.